What's up, YouTube? It's SK Shooting in here, and I'm back, and I'm bringing you a Pokemon SNY Wi-Fi battle number 20, and I'm going up against Sense. And as you can tell by what Pokemon have been brought, it's going to be a serious battle, a very serious battle. So, yeah, let's get into this. I'm going to bring out Raichu. He's going to start off with his Lantern, and I don't know if this Lantern has Voltorb or not. So the best thing I can do is hard switch out to Superior. My Superior can take anything it wants to do. And I can also get some HP back because Lantern has high HP and he's going to Aqua Ring. And that's going to even make it even more HP for me to get back if it's going to decide to stay in and keep healing itself. It's his choice, really. But anyway, um, get some HP back after he Hydro Pumped me, and just in case he was going to switch out, just going to Leaf Blade to see how much it's going to do. And I do over half, which is pretty cool for my Serperia. I love Serperia. It's good grass-type Pokemon. But I'm um, going to get some HP back from Offering, and my Leech Seed is like, no you don't. That's mine. So my Serperia is going to take that. And that's going to bring Sir Pierce HP almost back up to full. Yeah, I like how I said full. It sounds like full. But anyway, Sir Pierce, um, I'm just going to Leech Blade again. And he's going to switch out to Blazing Ken. I was like, oh, yeah. Um, come back, Sir Pierce. Um, Yeah, that Blazing Ken uh, probably is going to be a physical variant and uh, use Blaze Kick. And it does. But I'm bringing my float, so float, so handles it pretty well. And this blazing can have speed boost, so now I'm like, this is a physical sweeping uh, blazing can. Oh, uh, that speed boost is really going to come into play, so I have to get rid of this thing as fast as possible. But he braves bird me, and that's going to do damage to him. And I'm just going to serve. And that blazing can is one KO'd chicken. But anyway, um gonna bring about his lantern once again I don't know if this lantern is bolt absorb or water absorb I think it has water absorb I think that's one of its abilities but I don't want to find out I really don't so I'm just gonna switch into my Sir Pierce Sir Pierce takes the thunder really really well and he has no other choice but to switch out because he wants his lantern so I had figured that he was gonna switch out so I'm just gonna giga drain anything that comes in and Sir Pierce just can't take this Pokemon either. So I'm like, darn it. So um, in my mind, I'm like, if I get rid of his fire Pokemon, uh, Sir Pierce can basically take out any other Pokemon on its own by itself. And he's going to fire blast me, and that's going to take out Float. So I had another choice but to send him Float so because that Charizard fire blasting anything or hitting me with a special attack would just be too much. So now I'm able to switch into Raichu, and just in case it wants to Mega Evolve, I'm going to Nuzzle it. Um, Nuzzle, very good electric type move. It's like Thunder Wave, but even better, like way better. But I paralyze it, and he's going to Blast Burn and bring my Raichu down all the way to 24. And that's what I was talking about, like none of my Pokemon will probably want to get hit by a Fire type move on the Switch and then still try to attack this thing. But anyway, I'm going to vote, uh, not vote, um, I'm going to hit it with Electro Ball, his speed got lower so I'm able to take it out, and I'm going to strength his Lantern, uh, hoping that it would take it out, but it doesn't, and he's going to Hydro Pump me, and that's going to take out my Raichu. Raichu, thank you very much, you know, you did, you did a very good job with handling that Charizard for me. So now that his Lantern is down to a low HP, uh, if he, uh, switches out, uh, to anything. It's gonna take some high damage because my I just mega evolved in my Lucario. I'm just gonna start setting up some calm mind. So you know you can either stay in or you can switch out. It's your choice. I already calm mine up. My special attack went up, my special defense went up, and he just missed his thunder. So he's gonna stay in. I mean there's no I mean he could have switched out but whatever he would have switched out to would have just took too much damage and it wouldn't have not survived two hits. He's gonna switch out to Dragon Knight, and I'm like, okay, well, you can do that. I mean, hey, you know, do that if you want. I'm just gonna Dragon Pulse you. I had to have that coverage for Dragon types. And uh, it's 
takes his, his Dragon Knight all the way down to the red. I'm going to Dragon Pulse again. That's two hit. Clean, clean, clean two hit KO. And his Dragon Knight is gone. So I'm, you know, I'm like, I'm really having a good time here because, well, it's not a hard time. This is a serious battle, but it's not a, I'm not having a hard time where I'm struggling to win. I'm like really thinking my plays through and all. And I'm winning. But he's gonna bring out Mewtwo and then he mega evolved his Mewtwo. And I did not think I was faster this than this thing, but I am. I'm gonna Dragon Pulse. It doesn't even get up. It's, it's like a quarter damage. Uh, that means that thing has high special defense. Cause my Lucario has high special attack. But he has to have high special defense for that to only do a quarter damage to him. So I'm like, okay. So I'm switching in my superior and he's going to side strike me now. I thought my superior would be able to outspeed it, but it didn't. And that side strike is going to bring me down to 13. And I was like, okay. Most of my Pokemon can probably take one hit at least. Well, at the most, at least, at the most, one hit from Mewtwo. So I'm just going to leech seed it because I don't know what kind of set that he has. I don't know where his Eevees are for his Mewtwo. And. I don't want to, you know, risk it, so using a Leaf Blade or a Giga Drain wouldn't have been the best option. So I'm going to bring out my Garchomp, and he's going to Aura Spare my Garchomp, and it should bring him down to, like, half, I believe. No, nope, it was crit. It would have brought me down to half, but it was a critical hit. I had the Citrus Berry on my Garchomp, so I'm like, okay. I got Crunch as well, so let's see how much damage that does. Does it get rid of this Mewtwo? And it does. Mega Mewtwo is gone and I'm feeling so happy right now because whatever he brings in now like my team can handle it like my team can really handle it but he's gonna bring in his Ebeto and Oblivion wink me and I'm glad like I didn't go first because if I would went first it would have been getting a lot of HP back so Dragon Claw it does about a quarter damage he focus blast he missed I Dragon Claw him again it's gonna bring him down to half, like Lord in half, and he's gonna Dragon Claw me, and that's gonna take out my Garchomp. So now it's about to come to this. Like he actually caught back up to me, I believe. It's gonna come down to this. So I'm gonna sit out my Infernate. Now if my Infernate is fast enough, I can take out this Evetto. Like I really can't if it's fast enough. But it's not. And I was like, no, what's going on? Like. I had this battle in my hand. Like, what happened? Like, what happened? Did I? I thought I was playing really good, but I guess I wasn't. And that battle turned around on me, and I ended up losing. But thank you, Sense. That was a very good battle from you. Uh, could have gone either way, and I like the fact that it could have gone either way, and it really wasn't one-sided, even though it kind of looked like it was going to be. But thank you anyway. Anyway, uh, yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. That like button is, like, not too far from you, whatever device you're using. Um, also, the, the right, oh, excuse me, stumbling over my words. The Rival War is here. Go check those videos out. The part one of the Rival War is already up, so make sure you go and watch that because that's something you do not want to miss. Once again, like, comment, and subscribe to me. Thank you for watching.